Okay, so we come in a right angle triangle and we're asked to find one of the lengths, but we have a length and an angle. Now, whenever we have this situation, it's going to be trigonometry that we're going to be using. And the first stage of trigonometry is to label the sides. So you go opposite the right angle, and that's labeled the hypotenuse. Then you go opposite the marked angle, that's the one given to you in the question, and that's the opposite. And then you go uh, between the marked angle and the right angle, and that's the adjacent, and that's just the one left over. Next step is we're going to cross out the one we're not using in this question. Now the hypotenuse is 7.3, so that's interesting, we want to keep that. The adjacent is x, so that's interesting, we want to keep that. But the opposite doesn't really have anything next to it. Next we're going to do the soccer tower. And this is something you absolutely must uh, just learn. Okay, go around the room shouting Sokotoa until you remember it. Okay, it's not given to you in the test. And this is just a collection of three triangles. Okay, we're going to pick which triangle we're using. Now, So and Toa each have an opposite, and we've crossed the opposite out. So the only one with the adjacent and the hypotenuse is Ka. Now, at this stage, you can write cos x equals a over h, substitute it in and solve it. I'm going to do it a slightly different method. I'm going to do it with a triangle. And this triangle, you write, instead of c, c stands for cos the angle. So the angle is 42. It's always the angle. Then we're going to put a at the top. Now, a is just x in this question. And we're going to put 7.3, so the hypotenuse at the bottom right. Now the way of using this triangle is you times the ones at the bottom to get the one at the top. Now, a little bit of a tip. What I can what I always do is put the number in first and then times by cos sine or tan the angle. Okay? Now the reason for that is sometimes students forget to close the bracket and um, before they times by 7.3. So I'm going to type in 7.3 and you don't even need to type the times button. It'll work anyway. Uh, cos 42 and then close the bracket and that equals 5.4249 blah 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 and so to two decimal places that's going to be 5.42 now last step is just to check it the hypotenuse is 7.3 so the length uh, that we're finding has to be less than that which it is